if I had to sum up in one word the difference between the greats and the average, the difference between the successful and the nobodies of the world, one word, one attribute to describe the difference, discipline. If you don't have the discipline, you can forget about the trophy. You can forget about the success, the greatness. All champions have discipline. It's show day, baby. It's like 6.30 in the morning, though. That's very early. But we got a vlog to film. So you guys are watching right now how I'm currently looking this morning, feeling very good. I've... I've this is probably the best I've felt in terms of like every morning check-in, the whole prep, which is absolutely ideal. But your boy's hungry. I'm very hungry, so that means I'm gonna have to get some food in me. And I've got it all planned out. So sit back, enjoy my show day vlog madness. End of an absolute era, end of a journey, and it's gonna be a good one. Sick, right, meal one going down. So the plan is to probably have my bigger meal of the day now in terms of like intake of like chicken and rice and etc. But that's gonna have plenty of time to digest. And then after that, I'm literally just gonna eat little and often. Don't really know if I wanna eat chicken and rice immediately. <laughs> All right, meal one is, as you can see here, 125 grams of rice. 100 grams of chicken, completely plain, and I'm gonna sprinkle a little bit of salt in there. And then we've also got two cinnamon and raisin bagels, which I'm gonna have with 20 grams of peanut butter and 40 grams of reduced jam. I'm hungry. Mmm, that's fantastic. There's so much flavor. I feel like a right bodybuilder. <laughs> Fish and rice cake. Also with this meal, I'm gonna have 500 ml of water. I'm gonna be drinking literally throughout the whole day. But this is the only time I'm gonna have 500 ml. And then after this, it will just be a 300 ml bottle with every meal. And then 500 ml, no, yeah, 500 ml of downline root with this meal. And a thousand milligrams of vitamin C. All right, baby, it's game time. We're about to head to the venue, Ben Hall. And, well, we're gonna go a lot earlier than we need to, but because we just don't wanna, like, miss any tanning appointments, and there's no point lingering around at the hotel if you don't need to. So, plan of action, drive to the old Ben Hall. And then, ha <laughs> have a meal, just when we sort of get there, settle down a little bit. Plan on getting there at 9.30. Tanning's booked at 10.30, registration's at 11.30, and then just chilling out, eating, enjoying the sort of environment, talking to people and watching everyone on stage, because Mans is on in the second half of the day, which means I'm not on until after 4 p.m. Also, I'm gonna overlay a footage now of what I look like after my first meal this morning. I will be doing like, well, actually no, tell a lie. I was going to say I'll do regular physique updates throughout the day, but I'm definitely not because where the hell am I going to do them at the... Maybe, maybe I will. Who knows? But regardless, not 100% sure who I'm going to meet. There might even be some subscribers there, which is mental. But, yeah, it's going to be pretty, pretty madness. Pretty wavy. Pretty wavy. Mum and Dad are probably just finishing up with their breakfast. They're in a couple rooms down, so they're going to be in the vlog a little bit today. And I'm just gonna enjoy every second. Open my mouth to breathe the words to you. The words just won't come out, so I cried. Right on the canvas built from feeling, emotion persevering inside. It's just. 
One touch to open One touch to close One touch to show me Not all minds are cold One touch to loosen Loosen the hold This is the current situation where I'm, sat, I'm sat on the floor, I don't know if you guys can see Mill 2 is about to go down 20 to 10, so Basically the same food as earlier, just like less volume. And then you're gonna get tan at half ten. So that's gonna be the next thing that you guys see. And then we're just gonna enjoy watching all the competitors compete. I'm buzzing. I'm so excited to see like everyone's physiques. It's literally mad, like the bodybuilders are huge. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. This is pre lan lan, that's not a word. Pre tan layo two. So, see how dark, I don't know how much darker I can be. We shall find out. Maybe they'll do my face. 20 minutes later. <laughs> it's all right. Okay, so Mowgli just checking in here with the second layer of tan finito, man. Look, look how dark I am. I literally don't think I've ever been this tan for. It doesn't even look like me. It doesn't even look like, let's do it quick. <laughs> Mace, mum, mum quote herself, it makes your muscles pop, doesn't it mum? Okay, so now we're going to have more food, obviously, because um, that's all we seem to be doing at the moment, is food and tan. Well, that's how it goes, so... I'm not 100% sure what my next meal is, but I can tell you now what I've written down. Go on then, Mum. Mum. <laughs> okay, right, good. Um, 11 a.m. Just before four rice cakes. Okay, nothing special. Four rice cakes, 40 grams of jam. Bish, bash, bosh, man. I can't remember the last time I ate rice cakes, apart from like 20 in the last 10 minutes. What do you reckon? <laughs> would you know, no, what do you reckon of the uh, tan? Yeah, it's very good. You like it, you, you got look like a proper there. Greek boy. You look like a Greek boy. You look like a Greek boy. I don't think you're dark enough, do you? <laughs> I, don't think I'm dark I think you need three or four shades darker. What do you think of the whole like competing thing? Um. <laughs> I'm proud of we you. haven't seen it. Um, of course, I'm proud of you for getting to this level of fitness. But I haven't seen any. My mum hasn't seen. Yet. No, no. They're going to watch all of the bodybuilders and physique and figure. It's going to be a good one, isn't it? Absolutely. I just, I just think you need a few yiddoses. <laughs> I need some. I need to bulk up a little bit. <laughs> all right. Do a smile at the camera. I can take a screenshot. You ready? Right. Next meal, 10 past 11. Mm. 300 ml of water, four rice cakes, and 40 grams of jam. Now, there's not, this is just like a little top up. I'm not hungry like the adrenaline, but then at the same time, I can always eat. I love food. So, next meal is going to be in about an hour. And uh, I'm checking with you guys then. Oh. oh, God. Okay, we have the number 81 buzzing. So, Pretty much good to go now, literally just gonna be chilling and just watching all the competitors compete and eating some good food. So I'll check in with you guys for the next meal. Boom! Do you know what? We haven't had any wobs yet. So we're gonna do that right now, right here, right in the middle. Are you ready? I'm gonna. Mum's rocking UK DFBA. Good. Looks good, Mum. <laughs> I'm gonna get this show on the road. You Are you ready? Deal, We're gonna do it. We're gonna do it. We're gonna do it with the Jack, my boy. What up? What up? We're ready. Right. Gonna have another meal. Gonna sort myself out a little bit, but we've got some very good seats. Look how close we are. Well, not to my face. But. Wob. Oh. Here it goes a little 
do oh, we need like to do this. this. Oh, yes, yes. Next meal is about to go down now, which is what you guys are looking at. And it's basically 60 grams of rice, 50 grams of chicken, one Reese's cupcake, four rice cakes, and 40 grams of reduced sugar jam. And then I'm gonna have my final intake of dandelion root at 1,000 milligrams, and no, no, 500 milligrams of dandelion root, and 1,000 milligrams of vitamin C, and then th 300 ml of water. And that's it. So, gonna get that down me now. It's half past 12. And yeah, it should be kicking off any minute now. And today's contest is a fantastic start to the 2018 season. Just under 120 athletes registered to compete today. Tickets sold out a week ago. A far cry from the days when we struggled to fill half of this venue. And we've got you to thank for that. So thank you very much to everybody that has supported this contest. Right, it's about half past two. Next meal is one bagel, 40 grams of jam, and 300 ml of water. Oh, they're playing music. Yeah, boy. Oh. Yeah, boy. Damn. Many hours later. All right, I'm gonna quickly head backstage, start getting ready and popping up. Okay, bye. All right, so we're coming up to about quarter past six. It's been a long old day, but we are about to pump up. So quickly, just gonna take you guys through what I'm doing on my pump up, sort of like food. I'm gonna eat one of these Reese's cupcakes now. You don't have to do this, nothing special about it, but you should probably eat something sweet before you go on stage. So choose something you know your body's gonna digest well. Now I'm going to have the sips on this old Lucas Aid. I've got electrolytes in there. It's going to help me. Well, I don't know why it's going to help me, but it's going to help me. I'm going to have a scoop of pre workout and about half a teaspoon of sodium, which is about one gram. That's what's going to go down. Maybe Jack will film a little bit of me pumping up or something. And then it's showtime, baby. Buzz it. Let's get it, man. I'm so excited. This is what the last 16 weeks has come to. Man, just got off stage literally just now, absolutely buzzing. No placing, but I'll tell you what, I literally had the best time ever. I was smiling like non-stop and like 
all of those guys who won or came top five or regardless looked absolutely insane like literally mental but i was literally stood there like doing my poses thinking to myself man like i literally look the best i could do and have ever done and that's all that matters so we came here to do one thing and that was have a good time and experience it done exactly that and i'm very happy with the physique that i brought end of a journey end of an era and i hope i've showed you guys that you can sort of go through and do this sort of stuff and have a good time with it right so yeah that was mental literally mental and the thing is you've got to remember is like with all aspects of kind of like training and fitness is that there's always going to be a people that are like later on stages of like what their journey actually is so like all of those guys that are on there that did super super well like maybe they've done a few shows or maybe they're just like later on but you've got to remember is they weren't born like that man's did not come out of the womb looking like he-man or like some sort of like superman literally at some point all of those guys look similar to me and all they've done is consistently worked harder for longer like maybe i work just as hard as them but they've just been doing it for longer and you just gotta remember that as well don't compare where you are to where these other people are. i met geezer backstage just now actually same as me absolutely buzzing because his transformation is unreal and he was stood on that stage so proud of himself and he didn't place we didn't care because he literally knew that he's the best he's ever looked and that's all that matters he said he's coming back next year because he's fired up so that's all that matters now it's time to relax and we haven't like unfortunately for you guys we're not gonna binge out on like some crazy old like big 10k challenge meal like that's not what i want to do right now we're gonna go and find a nice place to eat a meal and yeah it probably will be well it's definitely gonna be a burger and yeah we will have a dessert but the fact of the matter is is i want to enjoy this with the time and the people and family around me those who are supporting me are my parents my dad's over here he might as well come and how was that? How was that for well you? Done, yeah. It's amazing. Mm -hmm. Very man. proud of you. So that's you a fantastic. Yeah, job. man. So that's the game plan. Um, I'll explain what's happening with the channel like later on in the future, sort of thing. There are going to be epic eating challenges. So like, I am going to start eating food, but it's going to be for a reason. So, all right, that's going to conclude this part of the thing. Thank you, everyone. Actually, any of the subscribers who come up to me here and say you watch my videos, that's mental. Like, you guys have no idea how much that means to me, and you guys even just saying that you like enjoy them, etc. And that for me is like. Yeah, I've never had that, so that for me is the first experience and crazy to think that that's happening, that people are like finding me through YouTube, which is mental. Right, anyway, um, congratulations to everyone who competed, you guys are mad, like amazing, and let's let's get out of Mum, come here. You, how do I get on? How do I get on? Was it good? I loved it, yeah? really good, yes. I really enjoyed it. Alright, I think this clip has gone on for far, oh, and actually Jack. Jack oh, needs yeah. to get there as well. Oh, yeah. Jack's been a big part of the prep. My boy here supporting me literally at the training session at the gym of the prep. My boy here supporting me literally at the training session at the gym. All around me are familiar faces, worn out places, worn out faces. Bright and early for the daily races. Go when I'm doing my cardio, comes up to me, talks to me, says I'm going, checks my posing. Tells you I'm looking good, like constant support, Tight. and it makes yeah, nah, man. Tight, Love legend. Oh, no right. peace. Let's go get some food. Eat. Okay, so we're switching the vlog onto the old iPhone because I left the camera in the car. But this is the restaurant of choice post show. We're at GBK, gonna enjoy some mad burger, maybe a little bit of cheesecake or whatever desserts they've got. But mums and dads have already gone in. Man's had to quickly get the vlog in as I'm walking in, so you guys can see because I know you love that shit. So after some deliberation, we're gonna go for the mighty burger. We're gonna go for some sweet potato fries, and we're gonna get some halloumi bites. Alright, so here's the current situation. We just finished up with that meal with my mum and dad. They've head home now. Didn't actually end up getting a dessert at the old GBK because there was nothing that like really stood out to us on the menu. Oh my god, this is like inception. So where are we at now? We are at just go better value for money and we're just gonna have a little walk around and just see like what takes our eye and just have a little treat we've got a two and a half hour drive home now so we just get some snacks yeah we just enjoy it just um, just carry on making some memories we're not going to go too mental i think i'm feeling maybe some crispy creams or something like that so i'm going to leave my phone to charge in the car whilst we go in there show you guys what we get after and then we'll 
finish this show day vlog here. It's been absolutely mental. Maybe Jack can like, should we see how the fucking, oh yeah, let's do this. Let's see how this burger meal, big old burger with the fries and stuff like that has affected how I'm looking. Maybe, am I bloated? Am I, am I, am I bloated like the females say? Right. Here we go. I have no idea, I feel very like, the beans. Oh no, you're still pretty sick, dude. You're still looking pretty tight, man. Yeah, man, you got the ass popping. Yeah, you're pretty good. I think we're pretty, it sounds like we're pretty good. I mean, we you still got a bicep? Oh, look at the contraction. The contraction. Oh, that's so freaking cool, dude. Oh my God, that's so fucking wicked. I'm, like, I'm just gonna go get some food. That tan really fucking suits you as well with that khaki jacket. Yeah, I know, it's good, isn't it? I got this from, um, it's actually from Hollister, now don't slack it, I know, year seven thing, but, man's check the, check the outfit. Check the outfit, do you know what I'm saying? O-T-T-D. <laughs> outfit of the day. Right, and, the D. Man should just do like, the you know, classic, get their legs out, but they've lost a bit of size, like, since uh, I've lost 15 kilos. Right, let's go get some food. It is coming to the end of the night, and we've done our little shopping test go. Like Jack's in here, munching away. Why is Kate's baby? Oi, oi, have you got your phone? Shine some, shine some light on this thing. They can see. Oh, that's perfect. Um, millionaire bites, some brownie bites, and just some few chocolate bars. Gone for Twix. Bueno and Double Decker. Right, fantastic. Jack there coming in with the old torch. Right, so that is going to conclude this show day vlog. Man, what a weekend, what a day. Like, I can't even think how crazy it's been. And going back and editing this, obviously you would have already seen it because it was already edited, but like, it's going to be crazy for me. But I did just want to say a massive thank you to everyone who's basically supported me or said like, go for it or like well go for it. he said go for it what does it even mean he's basically said like good luck etc that's what i'm trying to say and yeah so end of a series end of an era i've got loads of plans for this channel moving forward so trust me nothing's changing with regards to the wobs and you guys want to see the old dance moves do you know what i'm saying we'll just prop you up over here in the middle of tesco car park Let's do the outro. Start playing the outro music. Right guys, like, comment, subscribe. Leave a comment down below if you like the video. If you watched this far, I know this is gonna be a long vlog, but this is for me to look back on when I'm like with my children and stuff. Oh look, your dad competed in a men's physique show and this is the video and that rhyme. But if you watch this far, then comment below trolley park because man see trolley park over there we're at tesco trolley park whatever else you want to write just honestly stay happy keep positive and enjoy life peace yes we fucking did it we fucking did it dude